My name is Tetsuya Yoneda, and I'm an associate professor in the Department of Medical Physics here at Kumamoto University in Japan. My focus lies in the research, but I work very closely with a clinician in a MRI department at our university hospital and many more around the world. Since 2009, I have also been collaborating with Philips on a technique called SWEEP, developed for the susceptibility weighted imaging using the phase information. We use Philips MR system at the hospital, and I already have a high level of the trust in the company and its technical and clinical understanding. So for me, it was a logical next step to reach out to the Philips development team about the collaboration on the SIP. To make this collaboration a success, I needed as a partner I could trust and who was willing to invest time and effort. My interest in the topic began when I started to concentrate on the phase information on MRI data. I came to realize that this information sometimes looks a bit messy because of the large number of artifacts. So I set it to investigate a way to remove this aspect and improve the quality and contrast with susceptibility weighted imaging. By combining magnitude and phase information in SWEEP, I realized you could delineate the fine anatomical structure and rebuild even more into the cases. Phase selection and enhanced function in phase imaging are among the big advantages of the SWEEP. My work is grounded in the scientific research, but of course, it has the pragmatic goal of the supporting the clinicians. So I approached the neurologist, technologist, and the radiologist with my finding. They were very surprised at the level of contrast and the kind of the previously hidden information that they could now see. The neurologist in particular told me that this new level of detail and the layer of optical radiation they were now seeing on the images could very much improve the quality of the brain scans and help them detect neurovascular and neurodegenerative disease. Today, SWIP is routinely used in the neuro examinations at the hospital around the world, including here at our facility. It can image micro bleeds, down to very tiny bleeds thanks to the highest null and multi echo acquisition. Together with Philips, I am continuously looking at the way to enhance and improve the sweep. We are exploring options for extending the scope of the technology. I work with experts at the site around the world, and with Philips support, we submitted scientific abstracts for the congresses throughout the year. Philips has helped me to set up these collaborations and was certainly the right partner for me. We take our inspiration from the clinical domain. As I said earlier, I am a scientist, but SWIP is driven by the real-life application and it's our task to make it fit clinical demands.